<laughs> hey everyone hi welcome to tarot for today divine dabblings with oberon and me banshee and as part of our um i guess super tarot love week we decided to have a little fun and uh play a game together that we're going to introduce you to tonight called medium and I don't know why I didn't have to do it for Super Tarot Love Week, but I kind of felt as though, you know, this would be a lot of fun to see if we could connect with one another during, you know, mentally and psychically during this time of love, Mr. O. Well, all I can say is make mine medium rare. <laughs> or this could be a mitigated disaster. Well, in <laughs> fact, we did have a, a trial session or two and we laughed so much. Oh. <laughs> it so, was very fun. <laughs> so this medium, which is a game by something called Greater Than Games, um, basically is a game for two to eight players. And it's a very simple game. We're playing a version that is for two people. And basically the rules are simple no matter how you do this. I'm just going to pull out to show <laughs> you that the rules are very, very short. It's just this little small booklet. And so it's very, very short uh, and very, very simple. And so we're going to play the dumbed down version for two people. It's more for fun with two. You can, um, when you're playing with more people, you play for points. So basically in this box, I have sets of cards that are numbered sets. And you always take out one more set than you have number of people playing. So since there's two of us, I have already taken out and shuffled three sets of cards. And basically the cards have words on them. And so we are each dealt out, I believe it's six or seven cards. We're gonna draw, we're gonna do six. I can't remember the exact number. I'm fudging it here a little bit, but the idea is the same. I think you'll find this fun. You might want to look this game up. It's very amusing. So is it anything like Cards Against Humanity oh. or Cyanide and Happiness? <laughs> you mean Joking Hazard? Joking Hazard. Very embarrassingly <laughs> off-color games. But I mean, they share something in, in common at the well, core level, which is basically engaging people to talk with each sure. other There's and a, yes. the okay. idea of matching or mismatching words or concepts. But a lot of uh, adult party games are like that. So okay. it's so in this that is vein historically... of an adult party game. <clears throat> I see. Well, think of charades and some Pictionaries and games like that. They're kind of the same sort mm -hmm. of thing as well. But this one, you actually work with partners and you're trying to read each other's minds. So what I wanted to say is you get this word here, which in this case is Australia. And so then your partner picks a word from their hand. If I put this down, they pick a word and you have to find a word that connects the two concepts or the two words together. And so you look at each other deeply and you focus and you each say the word at the same time. And if you're wrong, like so often we are, <laughs> you have to take the two words that you both said and try to match those two up. And you got three attempts to try to match words and, and read, connect, connect minds. Well, let's just go ahead and do it yeah. because sometimes watching it happen might make it yeah. click easier for I people. I think you'll get the silly idea right away. <clears throat> okay, Mr. O, I think I have shuffled them enough here. I don't know. We shall see. And I'm going to draw... I will let you put down a word first, Mr. O. I'll put the pile in the middle, and basically the idea is that when you <clears throat> use a card, you'll be able to replace a card. <coughs> and okay. see what we have. And I am going to play the card Dirt. Uh-oh. Uh, what do I have with that? Let's see. Wow, this is tough. So I think I'm going to pick... 
Wow, what could we match on? I have no idea. I have picked the word elephant. So now we have elephant and dirt. <clears throat> so mm. let me stare at Mr. O. Ready? One, One two, two, three. three. Bam! Bombay. Bombay. Well, elephants live in Bombay, and maybe Bombay there's dirt, dirt there too. I thought maybe the elephant would need a bath. Okay, so we have Bombay and maybe bath. it's bathing in dirt. You know how they kick up <clears throat> sand and dirt sometimes to clean themselves, maybe. So now, because we did not guess a matching word, we have to try to guess the next matching word between what we did say, which was Bombay and dirt. Ba no bath. Oh, bath. Yeah, Bombay and bath. Oh my goodness. <clears throat> One. Wait, I don't have it yet. <laughs> I need to. Look at this. <laughs> um, okay. One, two, three. Hot Alliterative. Tub. <laughs> Alliterative. Oh, Bombay and Bath. <laughs> I think Sonny is displeased. <laughs> So, alliterative hot tub. <laughs> so, <laughs> any ideas? Or do we throw in the towel? Ah, bad hot tub pun, perhaps. <clears throat> One last attempt. Oh, my goodness. Alliterative and hot tub. I'll go for it, but I'm not sure. Let me see what you could be thinking. Oh, my gosh. It's really hard to figure this one out. Even a psychic has issues. <laughs> one, two, three. Words! What? Humid. Humid? Well, it's alliterative with hot tub. Oh, oh, that's very good. I think I really suck at this So guess thing. what, everybody? <laughs> We're the ones that read your cards. <laughs> Wait a minute. Here, <clears throat> take another card, Mr. Mister O. Maybe we'll have better luck. <clears throat> Got one for you. All right, so let me see. I'm going to put a card down. Let's see. Let's see if I can't find something simplistic that can't be screwed up. How about, oh, how about, <laughs> canoe? Right. Right? That's the one I picked. Oh my gosh. <clears throat> you know, you could look over your words a little bit and see if something might go with it. I was just waiting on you. I had already picked oh. right. But I was supposed to pick mine and put it down, and you oh, I guess I didn't that. understand that about the rules. <sighs> I just figured we picked two. That to me, that would be fun too. No, matching no, no, very it would not. Discordant kind of things. It means together. we'll never get it right. Well, that explains all our previous attempts, <laughs> doesn't it? Canoe and right. Hey, we got some right before, Mister O. I'm ready. I'll look into your eyes, though. I'm trying to project my thoughts. Gosh, you're trying to project something. I'm not sure what. Uh, canoe and right. Okay. One, two, three. Hemingway. <laughs> well, Hemingway and novel, there might be hope here. We're going to win. Oh, wait, except we probably wouldn't be able to choose the same one. Oh, <laughs> uh, no. So I said Hemingway and you said novel. Novel. Now, we're supposed to pick one word, but for some reason, I'm not sure one word will do. I don't think he had any one-word novel titles. No. <clears throat> one. If you had to pick a word, though, think about the word. Okay. Okay. That may be from one of the novels. I guess we shouldn't be talking this much. We're All hinting right. each other now. It's probably still not going to work. Oh, okay, are you oh, ready? Of course it won't. <laughs> One, two, two three. Sun. C. 
what you say? C. As in old man in the yes, sea. Yes, I could have sworn you the go sun with that one. also rises. Ah. But if I didn't pick that one, I think I was gonna put. Uh, what's the one with arm? Farewell, Farewell to, arms. to arms. Oh man. Okay, okay. So what do we have now? Zero. We have C. We. Oh. <laughs> C and sun. C and sun. Sun. Oh, mommy. Sea and sun. Ready? No. <laughs> I am, and it's almost Hemingway-ish. Oh, God. Yeah, that was a hint. She's not going to get it, though. I'm not. One, two, three. Fishing. Land. Fishing. What'd you say? Land. Landing sea. Well, <clears throat> Hemingway was a great fisher, sky. and of course, on the sea in a sunny day, he would like okay, to fish. Okay, this is an unmitigated disaster, Mr. O. <laughs> Who would want to play this game? Well, if you were betting, All right, let's you do could this bet again. That you would I'm going to let you us. put the word down first so that I can put the word down second. Yes, maybe that would it make probably it probably would eh? work better that way. Of course, well, you'll pick the most obtuse word you have, I'm sure. I have to pick this Okay, one. let's see what you got. Sun. Oh, my gosh. It's Is coming there a back. man? It's coming back. Then we could do sun man. <laughs> it's coming back for play. Sun. Oh, boy. <clears throat> you just don't know when to quit, do you? Caribbean. So Caribbean and sun. Uh-oh. I know this is going to be bad. Of course. All right. <laughs> One, two, three. Margaritaville. Because we're in the Caribbean and it's sunny and we're Wasting away in Margaritaville. I don't think he takes this game seriously. I put a lot of thought into that. Come on. All right. All right. <laughs> Tell you what. Hand me those cards, Mr. O. Hand me all of the cards. <laughs> You'll pick the cards. No, no. Give them back. Come on. <clears throat> We're going to start fresh. Of course, Sonny is on them all. Did I get them all? No, of course not, because he's on them, and he has scattered them all about. Is that all of them, Mr. Sun? Okay. <clears throat> he has a baleful look on his face. Okay, you guys, here's the situation. You're stuck with us until we match one of these. <gasps> you want to prove we can do this? The computer will run out of power first. <laughs> <laughs> Here. All right, let's see. Maybe you had too many choices. Maybe that's I want the you to put was. the word down first again. Oh, well then. Oh my <clears throat> goodness. This is wild. Halloween. Halloween? You asked for it. Fine. You asked for it too. And if you don't get this one... Halloween scientist, oh no, we're not going to do it. <clears throat> I have this bad feeling I know what you're going to say, and it's not what I'm going to say. But if you really thought about this logically, there is a connection. One, two, three. Dr. Costume. Frankenstein. Costume. You're dressed as a scientist. Halloween scientist. Halloween. That's Dr. Frankenstein. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I so really thought you would get Dr. this. Dr. Frankenstein in costume. Let's do it again. We'll just shorten it to Frankenstein. Okay, Dr. Frankenstein in costume. We'll say Frankenstein in costume, but it was Dr. Frankenstein. <clears throat> okay, Frankenstein in costume. Oh. Got it. I don't, but I'm ready. <laughs> One, two, three. Green. Monster. 
Now we've got green and monster. Great. That that's going to narrow it down. <laughs> <clears throat> oh, Spanguli, where are you? Green and monster. Oh, this is not going to work. I know because there's too many words there's to too identify. Many. One, oh, that's not going to work. One, two, three. Blob. Creature. Isn't the blob green? Yeah, but so is the creature from the Black Lagoon. <laughs> well, there's black in there, and it just didn't seem to resonate I wanted to, to say lagoon so that it would have been lagoon blob. <clears throat> <laughs> All right, let me try to put a word down, and let's see if you can't. For put something down that's down to Haven't earth. Haven't we wasted that. enough time on this? No, feature? we have not. Bus. Oh no. Magic. Bus. If We're you don't win. get this, <laughs> if you don't get this, Mister. Oh, all right. I'm if I was born to, thirty years later, I'm I wouldn't. I'm going to embed this into your brain. I already know what I was going to say, so unfortunately you can't change my mind from that. One, two, three. School! Who? The who? To board the magic bus? The magic school bus. Isn't that a thing? Magic bus. The who? Isn't the magic school bus a thing, though? Wasn't that a show or something? The magic school bus? I guess crazy? so, but I was going all the I way I thought back. for sure the you who? would get this. The, the who? who? To board the magic bus. Every day I wait in the queue to board the magic bus. Come on. <clears throat> I never oh, heard of that. Yes, you did. Oh, my God. I'm going to have to play it for the beginning of our next live stream. All right. You know, I thought <clears throat> we could make this easy. I'm, I'm going to pick another card just because. Do you want another card here? No, I think I want to be over. <laughs> okay, I think I've got this. Button. And mine was clock. One, two, three. Alarm! Alarm. Yes! Uh, as <laughs> God is my witness! <laughs> well, I'm sure this game is more fun with reasonable minds, uh, which Maybe we are more not. people to deflect off of. <laughs> but as you can see, we can have a lot of fun. <clears throat> and I think it is a lot of fun. And actually, it does work. It does work. As we just proved. So this was TFT. <laughs> Tarot, Tarot for, for today. today. Divide, Divide Dablings with Oberon. And me, Banshee, saying uh, maybe you'll have better luck reading your partner's mind than the two psychics had reading each other's. That's why it should always be medium well. <laughs> <laughs> Bye-bye till Bye. next time.